What's up guys, I hope you are all doing great. We are back. According to a recent claim from a reliable source on Samsung Li, the firm is planning to bring the display specifications of the standard Galaxy S24, S24 Plus and 24 Ultra closer together. It appears that the Korean tech giant has chosen to include its newest and most advanced technology in all three versions, rather than simply the Ultra as was customary in prior years. So according to the post on it, all three versions will have LTPO M13 screens with a peak brightness of 2500 nits. Only the Ultra members were able to achieve greater brightness up until now since they possessed LTPO screens. The resolution of the vanilla Galaxy S24's display and of course the three sizes will be the only differences for the upcoming generation. This indicates that non-Ultra models will now support variable refresh rate while the 2500 nits peak brightness probably relates to the panel's capacity to increase increased brightness when playing HDR compatible content. Even still, that value is quite remarkable. Offering the finest that Samsung has to offer makes perfect sense because the standard Galaxy S24 and 24 Plus are still regarded as flagship phones. So this change in approach is much needed. In addition to that piece of news, the Galaxy series color schemes for the year 2024 have been revealed and the colors black, gray, violet, and yellow might be the ones used in 2024. The initial pair are somewhat conventional and are commonly marketed as graphite and phantom black. Talking about the other two, the Galaxy's 23 series has pretty pale lavender and lime options that can't be called violet and certainly not yellow. The new Galaxy S23 FA has a purple option, but that may be quite right either. Here's what the Violet Galaxy S from Samsung's Set 21 series looked like when it was first released. We need to go even farther back in time to find yellow. Do you recall the Galaxy S10 A? There's no indication on when the several Samsung.com only colors will join the four primary colors though. Should be noted that the new titanium frames of the standard Galaxy's 24, S24 Plus and S24 Ultra will differ in appearance from the armor aluminum frames of the current S series phones, while the colors of the back panel might need to be adjusted in comparison to previous iterations. Finally, about the release date, it is anticipated that the S24 series will debut in January 2024. That said, I'll be ending the discussion for today. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below as well. If you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe. The tech chat is over and I am out.